So we have a Lenovo 4 Flex 1470. Um, recently uh, purchased this for about 50 bucks. It was said that the top two rows of keys here was not working due to some liquid damage. Uh, when I opened it up just to see if I could get to the keyboard, it was very difficult to get to the keyboard. Um, I'm going to have to purchase a, key a new keyboard and make another video about this some other time. However, I opened it up just to see if I could um, see what the liquid damage was and see if I could troubleshoot any of it. Um, I saw no liquid damage inside and it was very difficult to get to the keyboard again. I will not get to it until I actually have the replacement keyboard. Um, and um, again, I'll probably try to do another video. So after trying to piece this thing back together, it would not power back on. Um, it was a very strange issue. There, uh, we tried, I tried to put, uh, you know, paper or something to prevent because we thought maybe there was contact between the, the surface and the board, but there was no contact whatsoever. But the strangest thing is every single time we would lift up this corner just a tad, we were able to power it on without any problems. Just this corner, just a little bit of a tad. Um, over time, um, we spent probably so five, six hours trying to figure all this out. And with a lot of prayer and a lot of hope to get this working, um, it paid off and for, we just had an idea um, and I took this magnet with the board off because I was trying to replicate the problem off of the surface, away from the body of the, the uh, I, I just had the board and the battery separate. I put this magnet in the corner and I was able to replicate the problem. It would not power on. It stopped powering on because this magnet was at this corner. And that had me thinking to perhaps something within the body of this was magnetized somehow. And that's why it was not uh, turning on. So I started putting everything back together and um, it's probably not working right now. I'm gonna demonstrate, here's the button right here. And that right now it's actually working, which is good. However, before, clearly it would not work. What got it working was actually placing the magnet right here across the keys this is around funny enough the number five and number six key were the only keys that were working so i put the magnet over here in this area and you can get you can turn it on a couple more times and every single time it acts up you just put the magnet back there again and you'll be able to power it on again um i hope this will save somebody the trouble uh, thank God that it started working for us, um, and I'm hoping this will save you guys trouble and a lot of headache. Um, and again, I'll probably be posting, because most likely this is due to the liquid damage that uh, happened to the keyboard, which I haven't been able to see, but that that is the only thing that I, that is my take on what could be possibly wrong. Uh, thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. Thank you.